How's it going? Today we're going to be playing The Sims 4. I don't know who this kid is standing outside my house. Yeah, let him have it. What is your name again? Marley. I think she killed her. Ren Grove is dead. <laughs> Okay, anyways, they just released a new chef DLC, and if I'm not mistaken, I think you can open like a food stand, so that might be interesting. I do also have the dine out, uh, game pack, I think is what it is. We could do that too. Where does one find this stuff? Okay, let's sort it to home chef do you get the food stand i don't even know for sure if you can get a food stand as you can tell i don't look into these packs before i play i just kind of buy it and i'm like okay i'll just make a video on it now without looking into what you can actually do which i probably should so that i can avoid situations like this where i'm lost okay i don't know how to do this i don't know if you can in fact open a food stand it looked like you could but i don't know is it a job maybe purchase gifts what the hell is this a game of groans butterfly mcbutterfly face piano bars and you how to hold a note without a paper bag what you know i don't want to buy a gift should sandy invite classmate over stetson uh sure i don't know who that is okay so we could buy a restaurant sure buy a restaurant we could buy this little town square terrace it's like twenty thousand. that's like a quarter of my money but okay so right now it's set up as like a home uh we don't want that so we can make a menu i can do a custom menu okay i think this will be my menu you got water and a ham and cheese sandwich that's what we sell customer attire uh let's do swimwear oh, and i even get to make outfits for my employees this is bad i'm gonna spend like two hours just making outfits it's, well, wait a minute. If the customers are in swimwear, surely we should be in swimwear, right? Never mind. I want everyone to be gnomes. <laughs> I think that'll be good. Okay, there we go. Now everyone is going to be dressed as a gnome. Oh, wait, I still have to make a tire for the waiters and hosts. Okay, well, luckily it's quick. I just have to pick the gnome outfit. I realize that this is probably going to make this a lot difficult because I'm not going to know who's who when I actually have to run the restaurant, but I'll deal with it later. Okay, now everyone is dressed as gnomes and then the customers are coming in their swimwear let's put on some lot traits too make it a breeding ground at a restaurant okay let's actually start making the restaurant now right now it's just this uh little two-story home can i get like a big outdoor sign okay i guess that'll do i don't know what it says but this is the name of our restaurant and now that i'm thinking about it maybe a home and restaurant combo might be a good idea okay, we'll get rid of all this stuff actually wait a minute what if i just left the living room there and then just added in the stuff i needed and then all of our guests can come in and sit on the couch we'll have a very cozy restaurant okay so i need a chef station water station and host station so we got the host station here right the door waiter station oh damn where do i put this it's huge okay let's get rid of the table Put it outside i don't understand why it's trying to place like this if i do the other one Okay, there we go. That one works. Have some outside seating. We go. We'll put the trash can right next to the tables to make it extra gross. I have some room out here, too. Okay, we'll put a trash can here, too. Right between them. And that should be good. Oh, wait, we have a dumpster. Put it right at the front door. It's fine. I'll make the front smell like trash, but it's okay. All right. We got a restaurant all set up. Our house restaurant combo. Wait, what happened to my main course? Why did it disappear? Let's put my markup price at 300%. Okay, let's hire... Uh, let's hire you. You have no skills in cooking but that's fine let's just get the people with no skills no ability and completely underqualified for the job okay wait you have two in comedy you're fired yeah alice is better she's got nothing she's talentless okay let's open up our business look at my employee coming in he's a gnome or who is this no she's a gnome alice oh here's my other employee lavina i'm not gonna know what any of them look like oh here's the other one may oh our first customer he's in his swimwear there's not even a pool here it doesn't make any sense to be in the swim where it's just cold. They're probably walking in like, is this a restaurant or is this someone's house? There's not even a TV. Okay, I'll be nice. I'll buy them a TV just to have something for them to do. All right, there we go. There's their TV. I never said I was getting them a nice TV, just a TV. It's not even pointing the right way. I couldn't put it on the fireplace, so I just had to put it here. Look at this guy sitting by himself just drawing. In his swimwear at night, it's probably freezing out. Does it tell me the temperature? It's cold. If they show up in their swimwear, 
swimwear anyways. What is this? He doesn't like the- Oh wait, his rating just went down. You little shit. Just for that, I'm giving you three kids. Pregnancy phase in labor. Look at that. Spontaneous pregnancy. Where's he going? You can't just walk through the kitchen like that. This is chef's lair. Oh, I guess that's kind of the only way back here. I mean, there's a back door right here. Just go around. Look at my employees. This is so weird. I wish I could have more of them so I could just have an army of gnomes running around. What the hell? Where are you going? There's no one out here. Reveal the dish to no one. There's no one here. I love how it came out on a plate with that little top on it and she pulled it off and there was steam everywhere and then it's just a ham and cheese sandwich with some water. It's very underwhelming. What the hell? Where are you going? You can't just go anywhere in this restaurant. You have to sit down. I mean, who gets up at a restaurant and just starts walking around and eating? Like, you can't do that. I mean, maybe you can. I don't know if that's like not allowed and you can get kicked out for that, but... I don't know, I've never tried it. Oh, Marley's going to sleep in her bunny outfit. I want to have more waiters. I need to get more perk points. I need 900 to get another waiter? I only have 80. So far, my customers are saying I need better meal quality and better service. I don't understand what they even mean, I need better meal quality. All we give is a ham and cheese sandwich. I don't think it'd be that hard to make. I love this gnome outfit. They just look, like, kind of confused. They're like, what am I doing here? Why am I here again? Let's bring the family here. Have everyone pitch in. Wait, are they considered customers? They're all in their swimwear. God, Richard would wear a Speedo. Why is Harley not in his swimwear though? Change to your swimwear, Harley. Oh, it's because all of his outfits are the same. Okay, he is in his swimwear. It's just different. Wait, I think Alice's skills are actually going up from working here. Oh, look, my rating for my restaurant went up. I got half a star. Now we're at one and a half. That's better than one. I still haven't even utilized this new chef thing. I, I don't know what you do with it. Oh, Destiny aged up. Destiny has successfully completed high school. Huh, nice. I don't care. Look, this place is booming now. I mean, okay, I think most of them are my, are my family, but still. Let's have Richard cook a home-style recipe. I think that's new. Oh, we're at two stars now. Okay, well, he made the dog bone. Um, there's no dog around here, so I don't know who's gonna eat it. Oh, we can poison it? Okay, it's poisoned. No, oh, I don't want to poison Mare Whiskers. Why can I have someone else eat it? Here, have have Destiny eat it. Eat the poison meat pie. Oh, there she goes. She seems fine. She's going in for another bite. She's eaten half of it already. Well, she cleared the plate, and she's still alive. She didn't even seem affected by the poison. She's stretching. Oh, that was a good meal, man. I wish I could serve poisoned food. That would be fun. <laughs> Oh, Destiny's dying. Okay, the poison kicked in. But look, the Mayfield household recently moved in. That's fun. And the Delgado household recently adopted a cat. Okay, fine. Harley plead for Destiny. Oh, it didn't work. Oh, she was such a great drug dealer too. She actually wasn't. We didn't make any profit in that. <laughs> cheery tune. The Fintrick Fair has started. Come win amazing prizes by competing in competitions. My daughter just died. Well, actually, I don't, she wasn't even Richard's daughter. She was Marley's daughter, right? Yeah, she was the daughter of Otto and Marley. Wait, she's a half-sister? Yvette Balderas? Here's her grave. We'll leave it here. I didn't know she was an alien. Okay, Richard, this is your chance to talk with the Grim Reaper. Kiss his hands. Oh, I think he liked it. The forces of evil don't have time for romance. What kind of question is that? What are you talking about? about. Why is Marley getting upset? Oh, it's because they're... Are they married? Are they dating? What are they? Oh my god, she's slapping him. Why are you upset, Marley? You two hated each other anyways. <laughs> Look. Alice is very unsatisfied with her job. Trying giving a promotion or encouraging her to improve her morale? Well, that's too bad. I gave you the job and I'm paying you, aren't I? So you have to work for 22 hours. <laughs> okay, we'll close at 24. Fine. Just because you complained. You ruined it for everyone. What the hell is going on up here? What are these two people doing in the bathroom with my daughter? Wait, wait, what did his review say? I wish this place had more friendly service. Screw you, George Harrison. We have fantastic service. Nesta Wilder would like to come over to hang out. Why are you calling my daughter to ask about this? She's like nine. Sure, I don't know who Nesta Wilder is. I don't even know how you know her. Who the hell are you? How are they friends? Now May's complaining. Come on, guys. Guys, one more hour. We're at 23. We're a 24 hour restaurant. Oh, now Lavina's complaining. I don't know which is which. Oh, okay. Lavina's the chef. Who's the one that complained originally? I think it was Alice. She's the host. What the hell is she even doing? She's just like slapping the food. Oh my god, that's a lot. I don't think my chef knows how to cook very well. 
Look at that. What is she doing? She's just like slapping the food. We just have like a bunch of moronic gnomes running a restaurant. It is kind of a disaster, but it's great. Okay, we've been open for 24 hours. I think it's good for us to close up shop now. Congratulations, guys. You survived. After all that, we didn't even make a profit. We lost $46. Okay, everyone, go home now. Nest, can you please leave so that I can go home? Oh, okay, never mind. I can come home anyways. He's still in his Speedo, even though it's raining out. He's got an umbrella. Oh, nope, he put it away. Oh, I Okay, he can't make up his mind, I guess. I don't really know what to do in the chef DLC. I thought it said you could open, like, food stand or something, but I don't know how. Because I briefly looked over the little introduction thing it said when you buy it and you open the game. But I don't know how to do it. But yeah, I think we're gonna end it there. We had kind of a disastrous restaurant with a bunch of gnomes running the place. I think we looked into Dine Out more than the chef one. I don't actually know what it's called. I've just been calling it the chef DLC. I don't know what it is. But I don't know what to do. Like, I, I swear it said that you could open up, like, a food stand, but I don't know how to do it. Like, I tried looking through, like, my build menu, but I don't even see anything. Oh, it's called Home Chef Hustle. And, like, you can see all these items I have, but I don't know. Oh, it's right here. Well, if I had looked harder, then I would have seen it. God damn it. Okay, well, we'll just put it right there for next time. Well, wait a minute. Let me run out here and see. Hey, wait. You need to put stuff in your stock? Okay, so I put a bunch of items in there. Okay, I can start food sale. We're standing out here with a food stand in the rain. We call our food stand. Called it food and stuff. That's what it'll be called. Wait, Richard, where are you going? Oh, I have customers. Oh my god, look at how many there are. Oh my god, I'm making way more money off of this than I did with my restaurant. This is way more profitable. Markup prices, 300%. Things are about to get expensive. Come on, buy stuff. They're super expensive now. Oh wait, it only lasts for a certain amount of time? Okay, I was able to sell all this stuff. I made a thousand dollars. I made way more money off that than I did with my restaurant for a full 24 hours. I made that in like an hour. Hey, anyways, I realized I was about to end it and then I got distracted, but we did figure out the food stand. So at least we can say that was in the video, even though it's in the last like minute. But yeah, maybe we'll play around with this more. I wonder if there's a way that I can kill people with a restaurant. Why does it always come to this? I don't know what's wrong with me, but this is always what I do in the sims i just want to kill people <laughs> i should probably play a different game if that's what i want to do yeah i might look into it and see if you can do that because that would be fun whether it's a mod or in the base game but yeah i'm gonna go